Good morning guys, welcome back to the Arctivate YouTube channel. We are inside because we have something that we just got and we're gonna put it up and I may have mentioned it already. So let's go ahead and just, uh, well, here it is. Our new Christmas tree because I was tired of messing with the lights on the old one. So bye bye old tree, hello new tree. New tree, time to meet the decor. Wait a second, uh, cut. Roll that intro. And the reveal. Boom. Christmas tree's done. Okay, I'm just kidding. It's still in the box. But let's actually get it put up now. Well. All right, there we go. <laughs> and we got sit-ups going in there too. Five million and one. Five million and two. <laughs> one billion. These guys are so fast. They should start their own workout class. Yes, sir. Okay, guys, you can't see me. But as soon as I turn this camera, you're gonna be wowed, so hold on to your cups. Oh my gosh, there's like a human in front of it. You guys see that little human? It's a little Cohen. It's a little Cohen. Hello, guys! That is such a beautiful tree. Hello, guys! It doesn't even have ornaments on it. And then there's Snowman. And the Cohen. Well, the tree's up. The decorations aren't ready. So, the vlog will continue tomorrow. For now, I hope that you guys had a wonderful day. Have a great evening. I'm going to go and read a devotional, and then we'll end off the vlog. So, if you guys want to enjoy that, stick around, and I'll see you in like two minutes, my time. Like a second, your time. All right, so for the, debate, the, 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 the daily devotional book that I read is Day by Day Devotionals for Dads. <clears throat> However, this would pretty much fit a lot of people from at least some of the past ones that we've read haven't been specifically for dad, but some of them are. So just keep that in mind. And you guys can get the same book down in the description below. <clears throat> Today's Silent Pictures. Silence is the most perfect expression of scorn George Bernard Shaw there was a time when fathers who were the strong silent type were held in the highest esteem esteem whether they came home from work in overalls a gray flannel suit or military uniform they were not greeted at the door with a caprophony of hugs capophony of hugs and laughter as a matter of fact when papa came home the kids might be already tucked in bed or told let your father rest he's worked hard all day these men fathered from a distance moms did the day-to-day -day child rear rearing child rearing <clears throat> these silent fathers stepped in only when discipline was needed fear was the most was the motivator relationship was out of the question i'm guessing you are not that kind of dad still what what's your takeaway from such an image was that your father are you glad those days are over or do you yearn for a little more awe and reverence on some days do you think you're not getting the respect you deserve Let's strike a balance, men. The goal is relationship and respect. How do you get both? Availability, acceptance, and love lead to relationship. Consistency, protection, and accountability lead to respect. Lots of big words there, Dad. But park on each one for a moment and consider where you may or may not be getting the job done. What about you? If your dad was strong, silent type, the strong, silent type, you may be tempted to lament a lack of hugs and laughter in your boyhood home. 
Instead, I recommend you cut him some slack as long as he wasn't hostile or oppressive. Be grateful for the provision, protection, and strength of character he brought to the family. So, there we have it. That is today's devotional, and that is today's vlog. We didn't manage to get the Christmas tree up all the way, completely decorated, but we're almost there. It was a good start, and you know, it took a little bit of the store to pick out the right one, because we can't have real ones, because uh, otherwise, well, this would be the last vlog I ever made. <laughs> I would die within the next 24 hours if we had a real tree in the house. like. Not even kidding, I'm allergic to it. I touch it, I'd break out in a rash, and you, you, the rest would be history. <laughs> Anyways, I appreciate you guys for sticking around for that devotional. And if you enjoyed this video, definitely smash that thumbs up. Don't forget to click the red subscribe button. We're on our way to 1,500 subscribers. We're going to make a little pit stop at 1,400. And then, like, man, I really, I really hope that we can try and hit maybe 10K by in the month, in this next month. It sounds insane. But you know what? God's will be done. And if it is in his will for us to hit 10,000 subscribers by the end of the year, which is a month, so be it. I, it would be amazing. What a blessing it would be to see the channel grow 10 times by the time in, the, in a month. It would be amazing. Anyways, uh, we're coming down to the end of the year. I can't believe it. And, man, I don't know if I'm excited, sad, or upset. <laughs> Let me know what you think down below in the comments. Have a wonderful evening, a great day, great night, and we will catch you tomorrow. God bless. Don't ever give up. God is here with you. Yeah. You are a child. Nothing but love is true. Just got to fix of you. Keep your eyes on the prize. That's life everlasting. Only through Jesus Christ. He came to die.